Was there anything like, obviously there's lots of back and forth between you guys, was there anything, was there ever a time you hit a level where you were like, that can't go in the film? Yeah, we had a couple things. I'm actually, Fox has kind of made me <laughs> not talk about some of the harsher stuff, because I think it got kind of faux racist and uh, <laughs> like severely. Like, it's ironic, it's it was, fine. It, was more, it, it actually was just more, there's just, some of them were so dark. I mean, one yeah. of them's in the film, I think, that I say like, you're gonna die alone, or at least for <laughs> other people's sake, I hope that you do. Yeah. So, but it was like that kind of stuff. And then I, I think there's a really funny one, but just, you look like a trucker shit on your shoulders and then <laughs> shaped ears into it. You know, there was some stuff that was just yeah. like so ridiculous that even the director was going, this is obtuse, and yeah. no one is gonna be into it. You know, he's a very good improviser, so we would really go back and forth, you know? But it's like, somebody pulled your balls up through your mouth and then wrapped them around your head. Just things that like physically were even difficult to imagine, yeah. let's say. We tried to steer clear of those. I, I knew that he was funny, but then you get in the room, it's the same with anybody, you get in the room with some of these guys and it's just like, Holy smokes. As you're working with him, you're like, this guy knows his shit. There's a reason that yeah. he's in the position he's in. And that's Ryan Reynolds, is he can really, he can improvise with the best of them. Yeah. And I am the best of them. So we could improvise together. You are haunting. You look like an avocado had sex with an older avocado. Thank you.